Hello, this is uh, Jack Foley from How to Overcome Depression Now .net. Um, coming back to you with a, another video today on how to escape those depressive states that you may be experiencing to to start experiencing more happiness and more joy in your life. And I do hope you're getting some value out of these videos. Um, their objective is to you know just to increase your awareness to to show you that there are ways that you can uh, control your thinking that you can um, there are ways that you can experience a happy life and today's video is all about not dying with your music still inside you um, let me give you an example I do think that people who who suffer from these negative states, who, who suffer from depression, sometimes they are doing things that they just do not want to do. And I think to be successful and happy in life, you know, if you want to look at all the the, uh, the leaders in, in industry all over the world, in any industry, it's always people who have passion for what they do, you know, who really, really like and who really love what they do they don't they don't see it as work they, they see it as, as a, a source of energy and I do believe that everybody shows up here with a purpose on this earth I believe everybody comes here with a gift and I believe if you do some soul searching some people know it naturally and some people need to look for it but if you do some soul searching you will know deep down inside what you really want to do with your life. You will know what your gift is. You will know what you, what you enjoy doing because, you know, when you're in a job or when you're in an activity um, that you really enjoy doing, you don't look at your watch. You know, they call this the clock test um, at work or at anything. When you are not looking at your watch, as if to say, you know, when do you go home, when do you finish, that means you're really, really enjoying what you do. And so many people in the world, unfortunately, are not doing what they want to do. You know, work-wise, they mainly do it because of the, the, the financial rewards that they need to go out and make a living. And that's fine, you know, that, that needs to be done. But my advice, on this subject is is that you should do something you know that you are passionate about now sometimes what you're passionate about doesn't pay but until it pays you can do it part-time why do I say this because you will never be truly fulfilled and happy if you are not doing what you want to do with your life so in terms of depression I think that you know if you're doing something that you hate you know it may really affect your mental health you know definitely so my advice to you today is number one find out what you really want to do find find out what your gift is you may know it naturally two Search for ways that you can get into this field. You know, it may it may not be financially great. Uh, for example, some people are teachers. They shouldn't be teachers. Some people are bus drivers and they should be teachers. It's just that they never, they never followed what they really wanted to do. And, and as I said, sometimes it does take some soul searching. And you see this in a lot in modern society, people jumping around from career to career, making career changes a lot because they are not happy in what they are doing. And if you're not happy in what you're doing, it's very rare that you would be very, very good at it. And if you're not good at something, you cannot be fulfilled. Okay? I, I've said this many times in my videos. I would prefer to be earning far less money financially but doing something that I love than to be earning more money and doing something that I dislike. 
So find out what your gift is. Search for ways to get into that, into that sector, into that market. And if you can't make a living at it, you know, initially, do it part time until you can. Because as I've said, this area, this passion that you have will be a source of energy for you. The more times you do this, it stands to reason that the less you will be depressed. But the more time you are going to a job that you hate, it stands to reason that, you know, you'll be depressed more. So that's my video for today. You have a gift within you. If you don't know it, ask yourself, okay? Ask yourself or ask a, a close one. They will see your talents straight up. And, uh, you know, go after what you're passionate about. Life is too short. If you're in something that you dislike or you hate, you know, make plans to exit. Okay. So stay updated on my blog, how to overcome depression now.net or on my YouTube channel. See you soon. Stay updated.